Yo, what is going on guys? My name is of course Jad and welcome back to another video. So in today's video I'm going to be doing another updated FPS guide. The last one did very well so I thought I'd do another one covering more on the Windows side based part of it. So basically all of your performance settings set through Windows 10 and all of the settings set through GeForce to make sure you get maximum, maximum performance. If this video was useful please do hit that like button, make sure to subscribe and again show other people if they're getting lag in game. So what you want to do first is you want to go into your search bar and type in performance. You see just type in per, perf, and all you'll see is the adjust the appearance and performance of Windows. You're going to make sure you click on that, and all of these should be set to custom. So change it to custom. What you want to have put on is animate controls and elements inside of Windows, save taskbar thumbnail previews, and smooth edges of screen fonts. The only reason I have the smooth edges of screen fonts is it basically just makes, makes sure that everything else, so the text isn't too blocky and isn't too kind of we're hard to read so having smooth on just make sure that you are able to read that font and it just looks a bit more cleaner so click ok and exit out of that then you want to right click your desktop and go to nvidia control panel once you have that loaded up what you want to do is click the adjust image settings with preview make sure you're set to use my preference emphasizing and make sure you select all the way to performance just so that's set and you're done on that side so click apply and again just exit off of the control panel for the next one, what you want to do is you want to type in your control panel, make sure you put control panel, system, click system again. On the left hand side, you see advanced system settings. Click that, make sure you're to advanced, and then you're on performance. Go to advanced and make sure you're set to programs, adjust for best performance, and virtual memory should be set to what you have. For the next tip, you have to type in, in the search bar, percent, temp, percent, open that and delete every single temp file in your settings so i can't delete these right now the only one i can't delete is that last one but your temp folder should have a lot of files in it if you've never done this before i do mine on a regular just to make sure i get maximum fps in games so just delete all the temp files in that folder and you should be sorted for the next tip i'm going to be showing you how to turn off all of background apps you want to click into the windows settings here click settings make sure you go to privacy scroll all the way down and you will find background apps you want to make sure they're all turned off so it makes sure windows will not run any of these then after that what you want to do is you want to go back again go into gaming and turn off game bar make sure it says off and turn off game dvr and make sure it says off that is the first two things you want to do and that should be sorted so now we're going to go into the fortnite side of things and make sure all of your fortnite settings are completely set so you're going to get even more fps in game so now your Fortnite is open, you want to go into your settings, open up and go into your graphic settings. Make sure you set to full screen because full screen makes sure you have the most FPS you can. And then set the settings to what I have here. So view distance on medium, shadows is off, anti-aliasing on medium or off if you want to. I have mine as medium just because I like the smoother edges and everything else set to low. On here, I have mine at 1920 by 1080 but that is because I do not need to increase my FPS anymore. If you are struggling to reach that 144 or even 60 FPS march, make sure this is put to 98 no to 89.7 that is the last resolution that makes basically is a difference between 1080 and uh and this resolution here so it would, it would make it a little a little more blurry but apart from that you should get the most fps by having it on this setting here again you can slide down to the bottom if you would like but i do not recommend that having it on 89.7 is the best place to have it just because it basically increases as much fps as possible without having too little of a take on the graphics side of the game if this, if this guide was useful, please do hit that like button like I said at the start and share it around to people that might need this video. Thank you for watching. My name has been, of course, Jad. Peace.